element. Does that fix it? No. Give me a minute. There we go. Perfect. Ah. Uh, welcome. Welcome, welcome. I'm Kira and welcome to our live stream for today. So what we're doing is obviously we're playing Let's Go Pikachu. But we're not just playing Let's Go Pikachu. What we're doing is we want to see if you had three games on the Switch, how far into a living decks could you get with just these free games, no online, so there's no trading, just free games. And we've got Let's Go Eevee, we've got Shining Pearl, and we went with Shield. Those are the three games we're going to be playing. We're starting with Let's Go Eevee. Um, it's generally quick and sweet, and I want to make sure we get everything in it done by the time Arceus comes out, because then we'll want to play Arceus. Um, but I do want to get through part of Shining Pearl um, before Arceus comes out as well. So, we're playing with Joy-Con here. Yeah, we got the safety strap. We are good to go. Beautiful. I love this game. I like the Let's Go games. So, if you're not a Let's Go fan, I'm sorry. I'm really hoping we get a Let's Go Johto. That would just be uh, icing on the cake. Johto was my first. So, Gold, Silver, Crystal were my first games. Like I'm a Gen 2 kid. Um, that's where I came into the video games. I loved the anime long before. But I just, I wasn't of an age to really understand and play video games until Gen 2. But I was able of a, you know, kids, I grew up in the 90s. People just kind of plop their kids in front of TV. Whatever. It's kind of what they did. Yeah, so we're just going to begin. I really hope. I wish this game was uh, easier to play because you got to do the whole hand movement. So we need a living dex. That means we need, so if we have Bulbasaur, for instance, we need three of them. One to stay a Bulbasaur, one to evolve into an Ivysaur, and one that needs to go from I Bulbasaur, Ivysaur, and then into Venusaur. That's kind of the premises. You have a living of each of the evolution stages. Um, let me come over here and perfect. Oh, beautiful. We are. Oh, shit. I'm just going to do Kira. I'm not going to do, like, Moon or anything like that. It's just Kira. Yes, we are Kira. Oh, look at that Eevee. Um. Okay. <laughs> What theming, so we did books the last game we played during our Shining Pearl um, Let's Play. We did books. So we're going to do movies, movie characters. And we're going to name you, oh, I need, um, you know what? I just finished watching the Twilight movies the other night. Jasper. There we go. Yep, you're Jasper. The uh, the best Colin, by the way. Oh, this intro is really cute, but really, really long. Like, I'm someone, I just, I want to jump into games. I don't want to sit here through just button mashing to get through. Oh, that was a weird effect. Oh, 
What? I'm real? Kind of vibe, like, what? You have to come out of my TV? I think this layout is weird, like, having the bed. Like, the bed should at least be, like, up like this. Or, like, across like this. Like, the headboard right against this, coming this way. Or over on this wall, like, it's just, is that a huge ass? I feel like this leads to a balcony. There's no way this goes all the way and you're telling me it's not a door to a balcony. Come on up, Jess. Oh, look at the little, like, sweat droplet on his face and it just goes away. Uh, yeah, yeah, I totally read that email. Oh, look at the- I got an Eevee plushie sheet up in my, um, I got one of those nets. And it's got all my Eevees. Let's see, we're just gonna go. I don't want to talk to mom. Mom's boring. I just realized I did something bad that I'm going to have to. I'm going to have to go through. Okay, I'm going to come out. Yep. Needs help from the Pidgeys? What? What is with these professors not knowing how to... Okay, wait, never mind. He's talking to them. Why he was calling for help. Yeah, I need my Pokemon. Look at this feisty little thing. Hey, buddy! You want to join my team? Oh, look at those spiky hair. Oh, he looked at us like, hi. He looked at, he had the same look that Vessi when he's like, oh, mama, mama, I love you. Yeah, yeah, I understand. Yep, Joy-Con. Yep. A button. Throw the ball. Okay. Throw ball. Yay! First catch. Let's go, Evie. Let's go. So we got our first mon, which is an Evie. I don't know if your partner Pokemon can transfer over to uh, home, so we'll we'll still catch another one. Just be on the safe side. Ugh. Good bounce around. Oh, spicy! It does what it wants, okay? You can't blame it. What the heck? I've never seen that happen before, right? It's just feisty. Yeah, I want my, I want my Eevee. Give me my Eevee. He's like, finally, you came to get me, Mama. Now let me out of this stupid ball. Oh, this scene is precious. I love this scene. Let's go, buddy. You my best friend. Okay, we're almost, we're almost free. Um, yes, our Eevee needs to be named. Bruno. Wait, 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 are we, we got mail? How do I tell if I got a mail Eevee? It's not telling me the gender. 
Anyway. It doesn't matter. His name's Bruno. We'll find out later. What do you get? Oh, he gets Pikachu. That makes sense, because it's Pikachu EV. So what's in this Pokeball? Have we found out? I want to know what's in this. He needs a poke. No shit, bud. It's one more thing. Now that we saw our trainers, I'd like your help with something. Wait. Or we don't have to go pick up. You're just gonna give it to us. Excellent. You're not gonna turn me into your errand girl. Thank you. This is gonna be very helpful. In the coming uh, episodes here. Thank you. Thank you. Yep. Thank you. Let's go. Oh, there's Mama. Oh, uh, yeah, isn't he cute? Bruno's just the sweetest. Okay, let me go, Mama. Let me go on my adventure. Okay, excellent. Let's go, Evie. Let's go. Oh, Bell Sprout right off the bat. Let's go. Do I have? Oh shit, do we have balls? Did they give us balls? I don't know. We got any no balls. Apparently, we got balls because I'm throwing them, so. Yes, we got a Bell Sprout. We can catch Weeping Bell later, so we don't have to worry about anything like that. The way I like to do, um, if I'm doing like catch em alls and things like that kind of thing, is just go through the game, catch things normally, and then go back. Because oftentimes you come across evolutions later on. So you don't have to sit there. It's not Professor Oak's run. Where you have to level everything up before you go to the gym. So we can pr make progression. Even though we haven't caught, like, we don't have all the evolutions. Thank goodness. Because Professor Oak's runs. Ugh. I'm doing one out outside of stream right now and sword and shield and my personal save file and oh my gosh is it just a bitch and maybe I start with like one of the hardest ones but it, it was the one that I was playing so Excellent. Oh, look at that. I actually don't want any of these. And we got a Rattata. And Eradicate can be caught elsewhere. But yeah, party. Um, how do I... Through my box. Remove from party. Remove from party. Remove from party. I don't necessarily need any of these. Uh, Are you gonna bow me, kid? No. You're just gonna tell me about the scary ledges. Excellent. Okay. And 
excellent. Anything this way? Nope. Oh. Come on, Eve. I knew there was a bush around here that I reacted to. Oh, raspberry. Thanks. That's going to be really good eventually. Uh, probably not bring favorite yet. Okay. Oh, don't. I did not want that. I don't have the ability to do anything much here. So we're going to go off to the route going towards Victory Road. Thank you. Can you give me something or are you just looking at the pretty flowers? Oh, they're swaying. That's cute. How about you? Are you gonna... We're gonna catch some more... Or... We're not gonna catch... I really can't leave... Oh, okay. So we are being turned into an errand girl. What the fuck? And this needs to leave. I'm not gonna leave. Excellent. And this is falling asleep. Excellent. I just have all my shit just falling asleep and everything on me. Yes. Oh, excellent. I don't have to sit there and run back. Perfect. So what is this then? Oh, are we going to get to bow, um, Jasper? Yeah. Yeah. Bruno doesn't like Pokeballs. Live with it, Oak. I'm not going to force my Pokemon into a Pokeball. If he just rides on you like that. Yeah. It just attaches itself to my head. No big deal. No big deal at all. <laughs> there we go. Okay, yep, we're gonna battle Jasper. Excellent. Mine against yours. Let's go. My Eevee's better than your Pikachu. Hands down. Oh, look at his, like. Okay, you got a kind of badass Pikachu look going on there. Let's go. Um, quick attack. Oh, he's got a Thundershock move? Oh, ew. Okay, I did, I did more. I did more of my quick attack than you did with your electric move, so. And you're gonna try growling. Perfect. Get out of here. Come on, I got important shit to do. I got Pokemon to see, Pokemon to catch. Let's go. You're wasting my time and embarrassing yourself. Wait, did you see that? That was embarrassing to him, right? Yeah. You should be humiliated. Oh, who's this? Hey, Kara. Who are you? Are you? You need to the room. Okay, new clothes. That's excellent. I want to change. The starting outfit is so not feeling it. 
Oh, Evie, you want to play? I'll play with my partner. Yeah. Get your tail. Wait, your ear. Get your ear. Oh, he likes it. How do I? There we go. There, we played with the Eevee. We played with Bruno. You son of a bitch. You know what? We'll catch us just for the XP. Great throw. I mean, I got two. We could just do a wheel, too. <laughs> Maybe if we get um, some hard Pokemon coming up. Like when we go after the legendaries, we'll do a wheel a bit. Like, poof, 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 poof. just throw balls everywhere. Uh, level seven. Excellent. Uh, you know what? Sure, you can sit on our party. I don't care about you very much. Oh, 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 you're gonna give me something? All stars. I didn't give me a potion. Excellent, thank you. I appreciate it. Oh, you stupid bird. I'm running away. Because I can't kill you. I don't want to catch you. Oh, what do you want now? There's eyes. Oh. You didn't battle me last time. Why are you battling me now? You came through here already. Quick attack. Get this over and done with. It's a level 3 Rotata. Could have at least had us level 5 to start. That's what we were. I don't think any trainer battle in a game should start lower than your starting level. Stop. I'm gonna move this. Right here, so when it starts, I can just kind of wiggle it. Meant to change the uh, idle time on the Mac, but I forgot. Are you gonna tell me about Pokemon Centers? I already know. I've been playing this game for years. Not this necessarily game, but I've been playing Pokemon for years, okay? Okay, pal. Not newbie. I don't need your help. So, if you don't know, there's a secret. See? Secret potion! And if you're playing red, blue, or yellow, it's here. If you're playing uh, fire, red, leaf, green, it's there too. I can't remember if it's in uh, gold, silver, crystal, or soul, silver, heart, gold. It's this way. So this is, you can jump down the sledge. Oh, no. I got rewarded. Five Pokeballs, that's good. I think your Pokeball is like, you don't just find one. You generally find sets of five, right? Is that right or am I mistaken? Oh, Spiro. Spiro, come back! These things are nasty. Oh, you son of a bitch. Oh, I need to get ready after each one. Oh! Excellent! I didn't think that was an excellent throw. I butchered this catch. 
We added a Spiro. This is an excellent. So we come up here. What is up here? Why is this just... There's no way. Not something. Oh, Evie. I forgot. So Evie or Pikachu's tail is kind of like your dousing machine. If you get close to a hidden object, its tail starts going woo. So pay attention to its tail and you'll find hidden objects. Oh, need a reno. Actually, it's called it's just a Nidoran. It's Nidoran. The evolution is Nidorino. Nerino or Ninarina, depending on the gender there. It will be a Nidorino, so that's all that matters. Not this specific one, but... Okay, level 8. Perfect. Can I get a Mankey here? Is Mankey in the sea? A Pikachu exclusive. Okay, excellent. That's all I need to know. So we'll be getting Mankey in another game. Should probably have some sort of walkthrough route. Let's just. Oh, I didn't see you, you little sneaky rat. Oh, you can just go. I did not see you there. Don't think like we can find eggs or anything. Okay, I think we caught it. And if not, we can come back. We can def we can and will definitely come back. Anyway, um, come back here for a minute. You need to be removed from your party. Ends of a Spiro. Okay. Excellent. Uh, well, let's go get balls. Or we forget, and I made a terrible decision to come down this way. Ooh. Trainer school. Items aren't a thing in this game, so trainer school, like, it's not like they're gonna give me the quick claw. I want Pokeballs. There you go. This game is all about catching Pokemon. Therefore, we just need Pokeballs. Oh, I got three Premier Balls. I love it. Okay, we're done. We're on our way to Viridian City. Actually, we're in Viridian City. We're on our way out of Viridian City. Let me see. Okay, Viridian City. Bye. Oh, I think that was a moonstone there. Okay, we got a rat. A pigeon. I don't think we find anything new in that grass, so we can just keep going. Now in here, oh, in here we're going to find a lot of new shit. So. There's a Kukuna. Get that on our team as fast as we can, because it needs to get leveled. Excellent! Oh, you bitch. Just stay in the ball. Do I need a A spam? That didn't work. Oh, fuck. 
stay in the ball. Oh, wait, can't. A few different strategies. Oh, yeah, yay, you leveled up. I don't really need. Caught it just for the XP. So if it happens to level up into eradicate, excellent. If not, we can catch one. And we're gonna have a, a few mons that have to level up. Because that's just the easiest way to like Kakuna and Metapod. Easiest way is to just throw them on the team. Um Butterfruit. In one game you can get Butterfree, and the other game you can get B Drill. But they're super pain in the ass to get. Oh, fuck me. Why am I wasting balls? Thank you. Register my throws. I'm like throwing at not. Stay in the ball. So stay in the ball. So all you gotta do is just stay in the ball. Stay in the ball. Thank you. I appreciate it. Metapod, I appreciate you. Oh, we got a long way to go. Okay. Oh, I don't want a Pidgey. Who's over? I don't want Pidgeys. No evil Pidgeys. Oh, we got Pikachu already. Oh, shit. Yeah. Oh, come on. Let's go get the Pikachu. Let's go get the Pikachu. At least there's no breeding in this game. That is a, that is a massive plus here for us. Thank you. You jackass. Thank you. Now stay in the ball. Please. Come join our adventure. Thank you. Don't rattle me in the distance, sure. I don't know what that song is from, or if it's even. Sometimes I swear they're songs, but they're just, they're made up in my head. Don't come back to me in the distance, sure. Like, I don't know if that's part of a song, or if that's just something that popped in my head, and I'm like, yeah. I might not, it might be a part of a song, and I'm not even singing the cue. The correct tune, or anything like that, it's just, yeah. move sets on mons that I have no intention of using. I probably won't let them learn anything. Oh, there's a Weedle. Come on, Weedle. Let's go, Weedle. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Nice. Now stay in the ball. Stay in the ball. Yes. Perfect. Um, can we just how many of what do I have? So I still need a Kakuna. 
orange. I need a Kakuna. I need a Caterpie. And then, oh, there's a Kakuna. Talking of Kakuna, we will go get that. Oh, and there's a cat. There's two Caterpies over there. Dude, I had to run in front of this chick to battle. Weapons are gone. Luckily, this is where the Enfora is, so. There's plenty of them. Now we're just going to quick attack. Ooh, nicely done, Bruno. And another gotcha. Excellent, excellent. Yeah, 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 come here, come here, come here, come here. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, come join our adventure. We're having so much fun. Come join our adventure. Okay, so it's not gonna take so much to level up the Metapod. It's already level seven. And then there should be Caterpie, Caterpie, Caterpie. What was that? I did not see what, oh, there was glowing. It looked big. Excellent. <laughs> Yep. Okay. Please still be there. What was that? It looked big, but it could have just been a Pidgey. Uh, dual kick? Yeah. Not dual kick. Double kick. Yes, because that's going to be our lifesaver for Brock. There it is. It's not asking us to name anything. Oh, it's just a bell sprout. Are you gonna battle me? No. What's this way? Oh, you're gonna battle me though. So when we're here, because special spawns are some of those things that they only spawn in certain areas that you can get them. So in Viridian Forest, we have to leave with two Bulbasaurs. And to get Bulbasaur, we're gonna have to chain. So now that we pretty much have everything but Bulbasaur, the last thing we caught was a Caterpie, so we're going to start chaining Caterpies. So any Caterpie we see, we're gonna catch it. Until we see a Bulbasaur. Then we're going to catch a Bulbasaur, then we're just going to catch something and start chaining whatever that is. Unless we can get two Bulbasaurs on the screen at the same time, which I have done before. So it is possible to get both it, both your Bulbasaurs um, before breaking the chain. That way you don't have to chain again. Yeah, I see it. I'm not... Don't have to shake your tail so Oh, Beedrill, but never mind, we're not. We're going to get a Beedrill right now. Then we're going to chain. Because Beedrill. This is going to save us time. Oh, fuck. Um, the berries. Nana berries. Come here, Beedrill. Yes. Oh, fuck. No, I need to go. Thank you. <laughs> hate throwing off to the side. Excellent. Stay in the ball. Stay in the ball. Thank you. I appreciate it. 
when you cooperate with me, I appreciate it. I appreciate you. Be nice to them, you know. They might give you what you want. Um, please have nothing level up on me. I'm just gonna cancel any evolutions at this point. Especially that Caterpie. No, no, no. I don't need no more Metapox. Excellent. So, we're just going to go here. We don't need any cocooners. We need some party. Yeah. We need some party. Yeah. Some party. Excellent. And in the meantime, this guy here can get sent to the professor. Okay. And send. Because I no longer need him. Thank you. There we go, we got candy. We got tough candy. Okay. So now we're just going to go. Seems to be abundance of Metapod right now. So we're just going to catch the Metapod. Usually about 10. A good chain of 10 will usually spawn a Bulbasaur. Excellent. So right now, I need this Metapod to evolve. Not you. You can just sit. And the Rattata can do whatever it wants. Not too concerned about the Rattata. I don't have anything that has priority right now needing leveled up, so it, I can just sit there. I'm going to have two Bulbasaurs added that will need to come onto the squad for levels two one oh right in front of my face thank you it's time I mean, it's gonna be easier to catch if I just toss. You just be a baby metapod. So, Vince the Yeet, welcome to the channel and thank you for your follow. I just saw that there pop up. Seems like I got a delay because it's saying 12 minutes, but it just popped up for me now. So I apologize if uh, I didn't catch it earlier. Ah, uh, get in. Get in. Let's go. Awesome. Awesome sauce. There's size bonuses and everything. Is our catch combos free so far? We need 10 generally. We got two Caterpies here. My Kakuna just popped. Oh, here we go. Lots of Metapods here. Lots of Metapods to add to that combo. There we go. Easy peasy. This is a game that I like because this is a, a really fun, easy game. If you have young children who you want to introduce to Pokemon, or maybe you want to play with a niece or nephew, a younger cousin, this is a nice game because you can use the two, two controllers 
so they can sit there and catch and play with the mon beside you or it's a really easy the let's go game is a really easy for you know child first pokemon game because the mainstream games they can be difficult depending on what age group you're looking at there we go like my nephew who is three he loves pokemon that's my fault i love pokemon so uh he, he could barely walk and he was wearing pokemon shirts <laughs> um but he has um one he has diamond i believe and then i think he's got he's got one of sword or shield i don't know which one exactly and he's got pikachu because he loves pikachu and he struggles with the t two mainstream games. He's got to get his dad to help constantly. He's got to get his mom to help constantly. Um, because they're a lot for his three-year-old brain to be able to work through some of the solutions and puzzles and battles. Battle techniques, right? He's three. But let's go. He doesn't need help. He doesn't need assistance with this game. He can just go through and play and catch to his little heart's desire. So this is why I a lot of people criticize the Let's Go game, but that's why I love them. Because they're not meant for me, who has been playing Pokemon since she, I was a little girl in the 90s. Um, they're designed for the little kids of today, who this is very much probably their first Pokemon game. And it's a really good, easy, casual game. Like, I'm not, like, having to think and struggle with this one. Like, if you watched our Cynthia struggle the other night, um, you know. My brain power had to go into that. Like, the strategies and playing with move sets and held items. Like, that is so much for a three-year-old who really loves Pokemon and just wants to play a Pokemon game. Where Let's Go... Sure, there's some battles you might have a harder time with and need some more strategy with, but overall, you're not going to be like banging your head on your desk wondering why you can't get past this fight. The way we were with Cynthia the other night. Oh, MedPod, MedPod. Oh, no, MedPod. Excellent. There's two here for us. <laughs> Not to sound like a baby genius. <laughs> well, how old are you? Because, like, my nephew that I'm talking about, he's, he's only three, right? So, trying to distinguish how some people really hate this game. But, like, it's an ex- Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's a 27 here. So, like, you know, when we picked it up as kids, like, they were definitely hard. But we got into it pretty well. But, like, we want to get- Video games are, like, a mainstream thing now. Um, where they weren't so mainstream when I was growing up, at least in the area I grew up in. So for my nephew at three years old to be playing video games, that's pretty impressive. But like, I struggled with Cynthia last night. Like I was banging. <laughs> exactly. And I see that you follow the channel. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Okay, give me my Bulbasaur already. <laughs> I need two of them for this. Okay, let's go. Yes, I finished silver when I was a kid though. Yes, um, I think my first one was gold. I got gold and then crystal when it came out a few years later. Um, and then I went back to like the red, blue, and yellow a few years later. So I, I started with the gen two as well. And, like, they were amazing games at that time. Looking back now, like, even still, like, the nostalgia goggles are there, but they're still good games. Even if you gotta get through the graphics. <laughs> oh, yeah. Like, when I, I had my Mareep, and, like, that was just, that was my favorite at the time. Now, if you ask me what my favorite, it's definitely Eevee. But Mareep was, like always like I had to have one if I didn't have a Mareep on my team 
And when Crystal came out, I was so hyped because we had the female protagonist, right? But then there was no Marie, so I'm like, I don't want to play this game. Yes, I can play as a girl, but there's no Marie. There's no... My favorite Pokemon's not in. Why would I want to play it? Okay. Bulbasaur? Ugh. Another... Come on, at least let me get my chain going more. Yeah, um, I'm not huge into the anime scene. I have a few that I like. Um, mostly, um, uh, my niche is, like, Sailor Moon and obviously the Pokemon anime. But, like, um, obviously with us growing up in the 90s and stuff, like, Sailor Moon was a huge thing for little girls at the time. Like, my first backpack was a Sailor Moon backpack. So, like, that was kind of where my, um, start in. I didn't really get exposure to much else until later in life. Now, like, I get into, um, the Nar Naruto, Naruto, depending on who you ask, it's pronounced differently, and Avatar The Last Airbender I started, and I really have been liking it. I just like cows, Mildangle. <laughs> I, I have, um, I have some butthurt feelings about Miltank. Um... That Whitney fight will haunt me for the rest of my days. <laughs> Just as much as the Cynthia fight last night will. I'll be in my old age bitching about Cynthia and Whitney. And uh, everyone else around me will just look at me like I'm insane. No, no, that's true. I've, I've bred some really awesome ill tanks and they have gotten me through some really tough times before because they are pretty awesome. Just as long as they're not being used against me. Oh, come on. <gasps> Bulbasaur, yes! We got one out of two. <laughs> the cows and the bugs. I think... I'd have to say my favorite... Like, I love Eevees, mostly because they're so versatile. I can pretty much fit anything. Oh my gosh, this... Oh, no, no, I misjudged it. Come on. And I'm also partial to grass. Like, grass mons are adorable. They're usually flower-based, they're plant-based, and I like flowers and plants. So that that's usually where my partialness comes from, is if it's a grass type, I love it. Grass starters are generally where my heart's at. Um, although there's a few water types. Basically cute mons. That's so stereotypical, girl, but cute ones. I like a Syrian bug grass guy. <laughs> From Gen 5, yeah. Bug grass, that is a good combination, too. Okay, there's our Butterfree. Nice. But I'm definitely looking forward. Um, Legends Arceus is coming out. Swaddle is probably the cutest. I do like Swaddle. That is definitely like, he just looks so cute and like all comfy cozy. It's like, you don't want to disturb him. He looks like he's just having a good time. Just all cocooned up, comfy cozy. Kind of reminds me of my ferret when he uh, gets stuck in blankets. And it's just like, no, nah, I'm good here. Leave me be. Alright, so we do have to catch another Bulbasaur. So, hopefully, let's go. Me and our chain going, that means Caterpie, you're our chain. Let's go. Damn. The Butterfingers. So these metapods don't really matter, so they happen to evolve, so be it. Um, I do need to get that Bulbasaur so it can level up. Oh, I need it here. Oh, where are you? Add the party. Fairfree can come out. 
Excellent. So we are chaining caterpies at this time because that was the first thing that popped up on my screen. No, that was just a cuckoo in his head as we were walking away. Oh, you're a metapod. Maybe we should go back to metapods. They were plentiful. Oh, no, we got another caterpie. Not too bad. So I'm hoping we can get through this portion of our dex run pretty quickly so that we can um, start a bit of diamond and pearl, but we're going to be playing pearl um, just so that we can get a little bit underway before Arceus comes out because that's going to take our attention away from the dex run for a little bit. I have it on pre-order, so we're going to have all the fun pre-order bonuses if there are any. I haven't looked too much into that because I'm not I'm going to order the game regardless, so I don't generally care about pre-order bonuses unless it's like Resident Evil and it's something really, really cool because you can get the um, collector's editions and things like that, which comes with like maps and fun little things like that. I know you can get like certain ones, but the ones like for Diamond and Pearl, there's like these cheap looking keychain kind of things with the one. Uh, so I just went for a digital copy because you got extra quick balls. Quick balls, fast balls, depending on what you call them. Because in Gen 2, they were fast balls. And you would take the acorns to Kurt and he'd make fast balls. And then they changed it to quick balls. There's nothing. Yeah, stop spawning over there because I have to battle people and I don't want to battle people just yet. Not okay, we're going to venture in a little deeper. And we only have left to catch is another Bulbasaur, so... As we're clearing out the forest, we'll catch any caterpies we see until we can get a Bulbasaur here. And that went to sleep. What? There we go. You got a Weedle. Are you going to poison me? Probably. A quick attack here. I just kind of want to get through these weedles without being poisoned because I don't think I have an antidote. Or did I pick one up? I think I picked one up. And our beautiful Bruno is level 13 already. We're going to be ready for Brock. I tend to like if I'm not using um, proper um, type advantages and stuff, I tend to like to wait until around like 15, 14 and around there to take them on, just because that gives me like a, a safe distance. What was that that spawned? Come here, fight me. Are you not going to fight me? Oh. You were a waste. Are you gonna fight me? Yes. Excellent. And what are you gonna send? Need arena. We need one of those. I have the male version, so we'll have to find the female one. Oh, Bruno, you're just like massacring these things. Oh, last Brittany. 
Oh, and they give you po- I didn't notice that before. I probably noticed that in past playthroughs, but they give you Pokeballs. Like, I might not ever have to buy a Pokeball again if every trainer just gives me three of them for winning. Oh, get him, get him here. There we go. Oh, shit. I don't know if the mic picked that up, but that is the wind. We are uh, expecting some really severe snow here in Nova Scotia in the coming days. And uh, that windstorm, yeah, it's supposed to get really bad tomorrow. So hopefully everyone that's affected in the uh, Atlantic here stays safe the next few days. We don't want anyone getting hurt in this weather, that's for sure. I don't... Okay, what's this way? Oh, there we go. Anything down this way? Okay, so that just pumps out there. That comes loops around like that. There's a Caterpie. What is our chain at? We will find out on this capture. Excellent. Beautiful level up. And end up with some extra butter furries. That's not too bad. Because those will get sent to the professor. Okay, we're only at five. That's probably why we're not seeing any Bulbasaurs. It's usually around ten or so. Come on. And then once we get our second Bulbasaur, we can pretty much get out a lot of here. We'll have everything from the forest. And then move on, defeat Brock, and just keep going. Um, I tend to just like going through, get through all the gym leaders as quickly as we can because it's the catching part for dex runs that are usually for me the most important part. Trying to get things leveled throughout, but catching things pre evolve is the easiest way to go about anything. Six. We should have been able to go, yeah. Where do we have a Pikachu? I probably need another Pikachu, but we will. They are plentiful. I don't want to break my chain right now. Oh, I totally, oh. That is sneaky. I like it. I almost walked right past it. I just wasn't alert enough. Okay, so that comes around like this. Oh, what did I just run into? Shit, I gotta run away. Yes. Because that does not break my chain. I hope. It shouldn't, because we didn't throw a Pokeball. Encountering alone should not break my chain. <laughs> I don't know if it's, you know, you won't be able to see it because it's too dark back there, but uh, Vessner barely got his butt into his hammock, and he's just, like, struggling to get in. It's because you eat too much, bud. Just keep giving me these Pokeballs because I, I suck at throwing. I waste so many of them. Okay, and nothing this way. 
Oh, no, Kirby, Kirby. Bam. Come on, just easy capture. Yes, fodder. Oh, where, where, where is Bulbasaur? Okay, we're at seven. Maybe we'll get lucky with an early Bulbasaur. Nope. I don't have that kind of luck, do I? Oh, Pidgey, go away. Well, let's just battle this one and just keep going. As soon as we get to the end, hopefully we'll find one. I don't have much remove options because nobody's really useful but Bruno. So Bruno can just go. Not that I need anyone but Bruno. Bruno's just going to be solo running this, I guess. <laughs> the expression on their faces. I do like that about these games as well is the expression and the animation and just the art style it's done in a way that I, I just really like oh never copy oh come on it's just gotta stay in the ball. Oh, excellent. So does that mean you're going to stay in the ball? Excellent. Thank you. I appreciate that. Combo eight. Oh, you're in there to five. A lure. Oh, maybe we'll use that at some point if we're having issues. Excellent. I'm trying to think of other, other than starters that are special spawns that evolve multiple times. Because I know Mount Moon, the special spawn is Clefairy. Um, not Clefairy. Clef Clefa. Not Clefa. <laughs> it's that line. It's, um, it goes Clefairy to Clefable. My brain. Um, and so we can catch a Clefairy. That way we don't have to use a Moonstone on a Clefairy. We can just get a Clefair uh, Clefable and call it a day. Or we have the option that we can just catch two Cliff Fairy and do a Moonstone. That way, depending on how Mount Moon goes, we're not necessarily stuck here the way we are. This is the only way to find Bulbasaur other than the one you're given. So we're kind of stuck here looking for a Bulbasaur. Then again, we're also given a Bulbasaur in um, Sword and Shield. So at the end of the day, it doesn't matter where the mon what game mons come from. We could just say F it and stick with the one and two that we'll get from this game and move on. Which if we get to the end of the game, not the end of the game. The end of this route, and we haven't found one, I'd probably break my chain, get a Pikachu, and go. Or I might even just go, come back for the Pikachu. Because we're not going to get a Thunderstone for a while yet, so we don't necessarily need Pikachu right away. Look at that. Beautiful. Uh, 
and then look at that. We're at the end. So let's see if we can get, we'll catch that last Caterpie and just see what we can get to uh, spawn. And then if we can't get either to spawn, we'll just call it. Let's just see what it is that comes up. Oh, we are so ready for Brock. We'll just go in, give him a little uh, double kick action and call it a day. Uh, I don't usually use moves like sand attack. Not at this stage of the game anyway. Okay, you, come here. You get some critical capture. Oh, you can't break out of the ball like that? That was a good throw, man. Especially considering I followed up with that. I love you. Thank you. Let's go. Okay. We're at a combo of 11. Pikachu, Bulbasaur, Bulbasaur, Bulbasaur it is. And then we will come back, we'll either come back or we'll leave. Oh, are you going to give me attitude? Hi, the ring wouldn't even disappear. If you give me too much attitude, I'm just gonna go and get a different mod. Okay, excellent. Just stay in. Stay in the ball and we're all good. Excellent. Alright, so we're done with this forest. That Bulbasaur just needs to get on our team. And then we're good. We're going to go take on Brock. And then move on to the next part, which is the route before our Mount Moon. I don't believe we can catch. Can we catch a female Nidoran here? I don't think we can. If we can, we will come back at a later date for it. Oh. And Jasper's here. Excellent, Jasper. What are you up to? Oh no. Yeah, Brock can be a bit of a bitch if you uh don't know how you're doing. Or have the right attacks, or pretty much anything can be really difficult if you don't know what you're doing. Excellent. Let's go. Um, where is the, is it the center? Because I think the center should be here. Yeah. Right here, we'll heal up. We'll throw Bulbasaur that we just caught onto our team. And then we'll get rid of some of the excess mods, send them off to the professor, and then make our way. We will not double heal, we will not double heal. There we go. I am notorious for just um, button mashing, and then we get double heal, and it's like, I don't want that. Okay, so, first one's first. And the party. There we go. And now we're gonna organize a little bit. 
Because we got some of the starting. Oh, that's not what we want. Look at that. My button mashing. Okay, we want to move the Pokemon. There we go. Now it's starting to look a little bit better. Oh, I wanted to send some to the professor. Oh, well. No, I do want to do that because then it's going to get... It's going to get cluttered. What did I just do? That's not what I wanted. Now we hit Y. Um, send to Professor. Oh, that's in my party, so I can't. Okay, give me a moment. I have a nuisance calling my name. We'll be back in a minute.
Okay, my laundry needed changing. And where did my... Oh, here's my Joy-Con. Okay. I just need these. Um, did that leave me with one? I'll have two of those. Okay. Send that to the professor. I'm not sending anything I need, don't need. Excellent. And I'm just gonna remove. Yeah, you know what? Let's get. Oh, let's go, Brock. Let's go before I get distracted. Because that happens a lot with me. <laughs> Oh, this lady gives us uh, something for money. Like a big pearl or something, right? For watching. Yeah. Keep them. Yeah, I will definitely. Maybe he'll do tricks. I'll teach him how to do a trick. Oh. Look. <laughs> Oh, she's definitely watching him like he might do a trick. Would it really be relaxing just watching him? Or would it be more of the uh, just sitting there doing nothing that's relaxing? Yeah, big pro. Excellent. More Pokeballs. Goodness knows I will need them. The thing I like about this game too is you can't just go into gyms. You gotta meet certain requirements as well, which I found was very interesting from past games. Like this one, you gotta show a grass type. Or a water type, so grass or water. Here's my Bulbasaur. Look how pretty it is. Alright, we got two battles in the gym later, and they actually look like stadiums, too. Like, anyone in the town could come and watch and be like, yeah, we're just watching Pokemon battles. Like, that, when I imagine the Pokemon world and, like, how it's depicted in the anime and stuff, that is what you think of. Not just like, oh, it's just this big open arena for battling. It's like, no, you can have spectators. It's a sport. Um, Sword and Shield also... Um, really hammered home of it's a sport. It's as the same as us going to play soccer or watch a soccer game. I really like that. Oh no, it's defense curling. Oh, I didn't. Hey, dumbass. That's not super effective. If you use the move that's gonna actually do damage, you might have a better time. Excellent. Alright, next one. Stop right there, kid. What are you calling kid? Ten light years away. There we go, right off the bat. We're starting on a good foot. Alright, I really hope I don't get my ass kicked. <laughs> it's always embarrassing when you get your ass kicked. It's like, no! Okay. We're ready. Oh, we can't get up a sight. I don't like that. I should be able to stand tall right next to him. Instead, you put him up where I can't get to. That's rude. Let's go, Brock. Okay. 
Okay, so you got a level four Chia, level four, level eleven Chia dude. So I don't think, yeah, this isn't going to kill. Don't hurt Bruno too much, please. Okay, tackle. Okay, and that was a crit. Okay, this should take down the Geo dude. Then comes the Onyx. Onyx can be scary. Perfect. Level six, I'll take it. Oh, Menopod's going to evolve into a Butterfree. Oh no, we're going we're fine with Bruno. Okay. Ooh, level twelve. That's only two levels lower than us. Oh yeah. This is gonna take like a few hits. Headbutt, okay. It's not scary. He's not throwing out rock type moves at us just yet. Okay. I was expecting that to take a few more hits. But Eevee did good. Bruno did excellent. La Seven. Okay, so we got one at seven, one at ten. So hopefully we'll get some evolutions from them soon. And there's the Metapod. Oh, pretty butterfree. So that's our second one, so we don't necessarily need you. High, the tail high five. Oh, I love that. So we can get up to level 20 before they stop obeying us. Thank you, Brock. Bye, Brock. We're off the Misty now. Oh, and it's blue. I forgot he was in this game. Uh, I am. That's amazing. I know. We're just going to feed his ego. Because, you know, his head isn't big enough as is. I know how to beat the gym. I'm an expert trainer like me. It looks like I showed up too late, huh? Yeah, because I'm pretty good at this. Okay, now we got great balls, which would be nice for... Um, mons that are already evolved because they they can be a little tougher than base form for catching that's for sure okay I'm tired of blue let's go and is this going to be like other games? Like, do we have our... Let's go. Route free. What is on this way? Ah, excellent. I don't need to come back down anyway because that one on the bottom. So, Sarah, are you going to battle me? We got a nice Oddish. Oddish is a Pikachu exclusive, if I'm correct. Where's my notebook? I have the notebook on all the exclusives here. Ah, get out of here. Uh, correct. It is a Pikachu exclusive. So, we cannot get an Oddish from this game. We will be able to get it from a, another of our games. Um, probably so, um, Shield. 
because we'll be playing Shield for this uh, Dex run, because we're only using three games. We're using Eevee, Shield, and Pearl to see how many we can get before it's like, okay, now we need to start looking at either purchasing more games, purchasing an online subscription, or what? Just to see what what is the base? How far can you go with just three games to fill up an entire dex? There we go. I like the outfit on the picnickers, especially the female ones. The bow, if it was me, the bow could probably go. I'm not huge on frills and bows, but it's a pretty nice basic outfit. Ooh, coach trainer, let's, I feel, let's go for it. Let's go, come on. If you whoop my butt, I will accept it because these fights can be brutal. They usually have some sort of gimmick behind them as well. And then whatever like their little gimmick is, they'll usually give you like the TM for. That did nothing. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Oh, now he's going to leech seed. Oh. And that's how much is that going to heal up? Yeah, how much? Pretty much all the damage we just did. Okay. Let's get some stuff. That's so much better. And that hurt. Just a little bit. Alright, we should... Can we go down? If not this one, the next one for sure. Okay, yeah, next one for sure. How much are you healing? Ooh, I don't know. This should kill, right? I don't have damage calculators or anything up. Hey. I wasn't sure on that one, but... Okay, this wasn't so bad. What are you going to give me? These people give us something at the end, right? There's usually like a TM or something. Okay, revive. Revives are nice. We're doing a casual kind of go for oh so. It's not like it's a Nuzlocke where we're dead, we're dead. Okay, I need to heal up before we get too deep into this route because I decided to just jump from the gym to the route. That's not a smart decision. Let's go, Nurse Joy. Please heal my mons. I would love it if you heal Bruno up to full health. Okay, I need to get that Metapod out of there before it levels up, because that's my only Metapod left. And I don't need it leveling up. And then having to catch another one. Excellent. So this next route that's coming up, we're going to have to do at least a chain. At least a chain. Because we have Charmanders. Now we do get a Charmander in Sword and Shield. Leon gives us one. So we are going to count that one. So I only need one from a chain. And then we get a Squirtle as well in Sword and Shield. So we only need one chain Squirtle. So that's not too, too bad. We don't have to sit there and double train. 
chain anymore like we did in Viridian City because that I thought for sure we weren't going to get double Bulbasaur and then we would have to sit because I find chaining for Squirtle is worse for some reason um, I don't know if it's actually the encounter rate but Squirtle trying to get a chain going and I usually have to chain a lot longer than 10 to get Squirtle to come. I'm usually like in the 15 to 20 before I find a Squirtle. Unless I get super lucky. But just from my experience of playing in the past playthroughs, um, it's usually 15 to 20 before one shows up. And I'd rather not go through that twice. Okay, you're sending out Nidoran. So I should be able to get an Ekans on this coming route. Charmander. And what else? No, because Sand True. Sand is um Pikachu exclusive. So it won't be here. Um Oh, we'll just find out. Oh, right hat. No, I don't need you. Please go away. Just came out of the woodwork like running up on me like that. No thank you. I don't need. I want to at least catch Atkins first before I start my chain. Because then if I run into an Atkins and then like, oh, I need to break my chain, that's annoying. So I'll get the Atkins. We'll chain. And then we make our way from Mount Moon. Ooh, okay. You are not hitting very hard there. So I don't have to worry about you. Thank you for the XP, Robin. Oh, oh, right here, right here. Okay, excellent. Now, can I find Arbok anywhere? As of right now, I don't know. So I'm going to try and catch a second one. Just to be sure, because off the top of my head, I don't know if an Arbok could be caught. It probably can somewhere. But I would much rather just um, be on the safe side and have a second one ready to level up. Oh, you're a rat. You are a rat. Oh, 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 oh. Thank you. Heck, at this rate, we might as well just chain Ekans. Oh, that's not what I Thank you. Stay in. Let's go. Excellent. I love when my Pokemon stay. Look at that. We're already got levels coming out for Ekans. One in Leech Seed. Level 11. Excellent. Look at that, we're already at two combos, so we might as well just start comboing the snakes. The snakes. We've got rats out the butt right now. Oh, go away, rats. Okay, we're off. Oh, 
get that as soon as the only thing I Well, we got birds and rats. Open with Okay, we could use a lure if we're having issues finding the snakes. Because that would increase the Pokemon. Oh. Now I got birds. Okay. I can't get more to spawn, and I can't get bird more than birds. We will have to use a lure. Because I'm already at a nice catch combo. There's no point in breaking it. Okay. One more. Leave and come back, and if we can't find rat, rat, bird. Okay. Rat. Okay. It is la time. Thanks, rare Pokemon. More likely to use this. Let's go. Oh, snake, snake, snake. Dang. Oh, it's huge! Let's go. Oh, what the hell. No, you're supposed to get in my ball. Not try and bite the ball. Oh, come on. Stay in the nope. Apparently you don't want to come on a cool adventure with us. Is that what you want? You wanna be left behind? There you go. Sometimes you just gotta smack talk them. Little chirping never hurt nobody. Um, I don't care what you do, Rattata. Snake. Come on, we only need one Charmander here, so it's not like we need a super huge chain and that we need a chain more than once. We just need enough to get Charmander to spawn. Who knows, maybe we'll uh, get an arm buck before we even get to an area where we can catch one. I don't know off the top of my head what level anything evolves at. Uh, yes. Please, use another one. I only got two right now. Let's see what we can get. As many as we can before it wears off. Come on, just stay. Just stay. Gonna get left behind. Come on. I know you want to. Stay in excellent. Thank you for cooperating. It is appreciated. Holy shit, bring me with 16 already. Bulbasaur evolved at 16, right? I believe so. So we're at number five for catch combos. Come on. Ooh, 
That Rai is just traveling so far, man. Do you see it take off from there? Snake. There we go. Great throw. Just stay in the ball. Oh, come on. Stay. Come on. Excellent. Excellent. There we go. Oh, where, where, where's Charmander? Where, where, where is Charmander? Let's see if we can. So we have no more lures. There is no more. So we're going to just have to continue doing this the old fashioned way. Oh, there's not. And watch me be in the wrong area. At that. I believe we get Charmanders here. It could be on the other side of Mount Moon that I'm thinking of. So, uh, if anyone knows the answer to that and knows if I'm being a dum dum, let me know. Because I, I'm contrary to what some people might say about me, I am not a Pokemon expert. I. Nah, nah. I'm barely, I'm barely good at Pokemon. I, I just enjoy Pokemon. Rat, bird, rat. Snake. Okay, and go. Come on. Stupid. Oh, this is a great throw. So great, seeing the ball because it was amazing. Okay, yes, we caught it. Where are we at now? We're at eight. Come on, eight should be a that's a good number. Give me a Charmander. Okay, no, nope. but we got another snack. So it's only oh, so tiny. Oh, mm, caboodle. Come on. Come on. Okay. Uh, give me a moment. I need to just let her know it needs to go on again. Turn my dryer. Adulting sucks sometimes when it comes to laundry. Laundry and cooking. Laundry and cooking are my worst two things that I would rather not do. I would rather shovel a really long driveway from waist deep snow than do laundry. But I like wearing clean clothes, so it has to be done. And there's another snake. Just give us a Charmander already. Come on. That was easy. That one was a good one. Okay, we're at 10. 10 seems to be a really good number for spawns, special spawns. So. 
Is there a grass over this way? I will come back and fight you, I promise. I think there's grass over this way. Oh, yes. Can you give me grass? This is the grass I was thinking of for Charmander, was this area. So it is before Mount Moon. Okay. We can definitely get a Charmander before we go Mount Moon. Oh, so I'm trying to eat my Pokeballs. Don't appreciate it, Ekans. <sighs> Come on. Great throw. Let's go. Gonna give it the death glare. Excellent. Okay, we got a level. Oh, not a level. We got a combo of 11. Oh, can I just pick this up first, Charmander? Oh, it's a revive. Thank you. Here we go. Come join our adventure, Charmander. Oh, what the fuck was that? Not just nope. Okay, I'm gonna wait. Oh, that overshot is so bad. Oh. I need more Pokeballs. I'm gonna need to run back all the way to the other city because I need Pokeballs before we go into Mount Moon. That's embarrassing. That is, that is embarrassing, this froze. Ugh. One just goes all the way, like, curves, and the other's just overshot so bad, and the other one just barely touched it. Charmander. We need to go back and get no. First things first, add to the party. This one. And then we want to Mew Pokemon. So it goes Bulbasaur, Squirtle. And then Charmander. Actually, I'm going to move you there. Alright, so now we can go back and get Pokeballs because we need them. Please look the other way. Our stash is dwindling, so, um, yeah. If somebody can't throw, worth anything. Like, if you told me, hey, throw this at a target, or you're going to die, I'm dead. <laughs> that is how bad my arm aim, which is fine. Oh, let's just get some great balls. Oh, I can get. Oh, never mind. How many can we get? 14? 14 sounds good. I can get a premier ball. Excellent. Uh, we are just going to heal. I, do I have money? I don't have money for escape rope. Sorry. Oh, but you know what? Ha! Hey, hey, hey. I can sell. Well, I only have one. Why does it give me the option with arrows? Um, I mean, we can sell candies, but I don't think we need to. I do want a single escape rope, just in case. Just in case we need to escape because we're hurt. 
and like need to get out of there. Hmm. How many can I get? Let's get the 37. There we go. All right, now we are stacked. We're going to go heal and then we're just going to continue on. Or you know what? We won't heal here. We will heal right before Mount Moon because we're not hurting just yet. But we will want to have a heal before we venture in. So let's just go. No more wasting time. We got two battles here, at least. We're gonna battle me? I'm a kid. I like sure she come here. Okay, there you go. Why why was that so hard? So a single rattata. And quick pot. That's literally we're ten levels above. There's no way it doesn't kill. There's no items, so we don't have to worry about like focus sash. Um, I don't think there's abilities, so we don't have to worry about things like uh, sturdy and things like that. So. It's definitely baby's first Pokemon game, which is nice. Kakuna, do you have? Oh, no, it's just Kakuna. And I don't think we're supposed to be the level we are at this point in the game. You're supposed to generally use multiple Pokemon. But we're just kind of steamrolling ahead here with uh, Bruno. What are you doing sitting on this rock? Can you tell me? No, you're just taking a rest? Okay, that's fair. That's valid. Nothing here. At least I think. Evie, what's your tail say? Nope. We will battle him in a moment. Okay. Yeah, battle. Let's go. It's probably so right around Mount Moon. So what? You probably have like a Clefairy or something. Meowth, okay. Meowth. Meowth, where do we get Meowth from? The route going down, right? From Cerulean? Got Cerulean to, um, I'm trying to remember the Kanto map. He's not Celadon. Celadon. No, there is Celadon. But we can't get to, so we gotta go to the underground, which goes to Virilian? Look, Virilian City is over there. Where's Surge? What city is Surge in? That city. That's the one we're talking about. The daycare's on that route, right? That's where we can find a meow? We're gonna need at least three meows. No, four meows. There's meow. Yeah. And actually, I think we're gonna need more. Because do we not show five, at least five meows for a oh, payday? Payday is not bad. Um, and they give you an Arcanine. Nothing? Okay.
Nothing? Okay. Well, this girl. She's gonna bow me? Nope. Oh, didn't have to buy one. Oh well. It's always good to have escape ropes. Me and the Mount Moon from far away because I want a Pokemon I can ride on. That's right, you can ride on certain Pokemon like Onyx. Okay, so we're gonna go heal before we venture in. Excellent. Uh, no double, yes, no double heal. Excellent, excellent. Everything is just working the plan today. Look at that. I love this little detail, the little meow, just sleeping up there. It's probably Team Rocket's meow, because you do find Team Rocket in here. He's probably supposed to be on guard, and he's like, I'm just gonna nap. Nothing's happening. Yep, there they are. Well, let's just sift further in. Yeah, sift further in. I mean, you're talking in a public place. Is it really eavesdropping if you're having an out loud conversation? Yeah, it is their meow. <laughs> Slacking on the job there. Nice potion, excellent. Uh, okay, Chia dude, let's go. Get your Pokemon for the moving ring and make me a bone. Okay, I've been, I've been doing that for like, last like, ow, two hours. Yeah, last like two hours we've been doing this. And now you're going to tell me, like, that's information that should have been given out earlier. Oh, shit. Come on, in the ball. Thank you. I appreciate that. Um, who's learning bite? I don't know, but we'll let them learn bite. Oh, yes, I want you to learn bite. Excellent, that is an excellent move, and I want you to know it. Learn smoke screen. Smoke screen's a good one. I've learned from our last, our, our Shining Pearl playthrough, that evasive moves are our friend because that mud slap saved us so so many times oh you saw us all the way over here that is a huge distance my friend it is dark as shit in these caves Butterfree and nothing else. Let's bite. We, we learned a new move. Let's use it. Okay, that did nothing. I thought that was going to do a, a little bit more damage than what it did, but no. Bug Catcher Kent was his name. Five Great Balls says I excellent. I will never say okay, Zubat, come here. Come here, Zubat. Oh, I hate flying mons. 
That was pretty. Oh, I'm pretty impressed with that one. There we go. Excellent. Oh, I was scared we were going to be here for a while trying with that Zubat. We can catch Golbat later. So Zubat's fine. Zubat's all we need. No, no, go away. What? I'm waiting for my friend to find me to find you here. Do have you told them this is where you are? Because I my first instincts wouldn't be, hey, I should look for my friend in a cave. Um, bite to a grass type should do. Oh yeah. That was nice. You have a bell sprout. <laughs> what do you, why are you so surprised you've lost? I like how it kind of leads you so um, to the right way, but we're going to go down here. Just kind of stop at these craters as well and just kind of let your EV um, see if there's anything in there. See, like a moonstone. That is very important. And a rare candy. Um, Paris is usually in amongst. Shit, there's so many. Oh my god, I'm gonna get overrun. <laughs> I almost ran into a Chia dude when this guy caught me. <laughs> oh, there's so many on the screen. Is this the only floor to find Paris? I'm pretty sure Mount Moon is the only place to find Paris, right? Right? I don't know. I'm not... I have played the Let's Go like five times in the past since it's came out. And that's start to finish. I've had some playthroughs where I started and then I got sidetracked with other games and other things. And so I kind of like go to the wayside and then I'm like, I don't know anything about what I was doing with this save. Like it was, I trying to do a challenge run or anything like that. So I would just start over with what I was feeling in the time, whether it be a Nuzlocke, a Professor Oaks run, a common, just a regular playthrough. Um, so from start to finish, I have, Oh, what did I run into? Um, we definitely can get Graveler elsewhere, so I have no use. Uh, Parrot, no. Oh, I had one. I had one, but I got too close to the ladder. Ooh. That sucked. Oh, 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 come here, come here, come here. Come here, sweet boy. Let's just shake it off like I, I apologize, sweet girl. Come on, beautiful, stay in the ball for me. Oh, okay. Let's go. Let's go. Just come on. Do I need to give you a berry after this if you don't stay in? Okay. 
Thank you. Thank you, beautiful. I appreciate you staying in. I do need another Paris, though. Uh, poison powder? Sure. Sure, poison powder is a good one. I do need something with, like, Thunder Wave. Uh, not, you can't even... Thunder Wave and stuff doesn't even count for this game because I can't use them on Pokemon. So, like, no, there's no point. There's no point in the status ones. Because we're just going to use our OP um, Eevee, partner Eevee, for anything big and massive. We don't really need a full team when it comes to just powering through. At least the way we're playing right now. I need another Paris, please, because I don't know anywhere else that I can get them. Or if I can catch Parasect. Stay away from that. Okay, too many, too many. I'm getting overwhelmed. Oh, that was dirty spawn. Oh, there, 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 there. Now we need a distant show. Come on. Oh yeah, baby. Let's go. Okay, so we are done here. Well, okay, I catch combo two. I didn't know if this was the only one that have them or not, so I was just like, "Oh, I you were barely touching me. You barely touched me. Let's go. no." <laughs> I just keep getting dirty spawned. Oh, no, that's not what I want it. I guess. Anyway, where's this Paris? We're spawn we're training Paris right now. Because that will get our Cliff Fable. Stay, stay, stay in the ball. Thank you. Um, because if we can get a Cliff Fable, we can save a mood stone. Pretty Pretty straightforward with that. Um, we still need for Jiggly um, Jigglypuff because it's in this game. Then Nito's as well. Okay, we're coming down this way. Woohoo! Don't sneak up! I you turn to me. I did no such sneaking. Hey, Brimer. Which is a Poke uh, Pikachu exclusive. So. We can't get one here. That sucks. Oh, I have an antidote. I hope. I think so. So that took quick attack because that stab will do. Okay. 
That's not very nice, Grimer. The poison people. So we're going to uh, heal. He might even leave to heal. So I want to kind of keep our healing items for when we're deeper into the cave. Oh, ethers are nice. It'll be nice towards the end of the, uh, oh, purse, purse, purse. Now, I don't, here's my problem now. I have a nice chain going. I don't want to leave and break it, but I want to save my healing items for when we're deeper. That way we don't have to be like, okay, I have no way to heal at all. I think there's a doctor somewhere in this cave. So we're going to take a risk here. Because our, our combo's already at four here. We're going to risk and reward. So our risk is that we're going to use our healing items and there's no doctor. And we're going to have to come back after using an escape rope, breaking our chain before we get a cliff able. But the reward is we don't break our chain now. So, and don't break our chain and there's a doctor, that's the reward. So, we weighed it, we made our decision. Now we just got to see whether we reap that reward or we made a dud, dud mistake. Okay, I need to go back to that kid. There we go. Now, can I find Paris on every floor is the question. So I can find him here and the one with that grunt. So I'm assuming I can find him on every floor. Excuse me, Keith. Bye-bye. So long. Farewell, Adidas, say goodnight. Um, Rattata evolves. Oh, I just realized something. I'm going to need to more Rattatas. Ooh. That's okay. We can find them pretty much anywhere. They're like real rats. They just show up everywhere. Um... Okay, so that is the one we went down. I was just checking. I was about to say, are you going to turn and fight? Or are you just going to ignore us and turn every other which way? Miriam. Hey, you got a Clefairy. I need one of those. Got any advice on, uh, Getting a clefable, clefable. A uh, bite should do, right? Remember my tape. Not very effective. Okay. Anyway, it does a lot of damage, so we'll just continue. Defense curl. That shouldn't make any difference. This is still gonna be a three-hit kill.
down it goes. Oh, I lost? Yeah, you did, you lost. Oh, oh, no, go away, go away there. Yes. I don't know. I don't know how I'm frying that I get just so off. Okay, that's an excellent. Excellent. I knew that was gonna hit. Come on, come on. Yes. Yes. Multiply bonus. Okay, so Bulbasaur should be evolving soon. Charmander's getting up there, so it will evolve soon. No. I've already decided that there's no outside of trainer battle. There's no point in you learning any of those. Uh, bite? No. There's no mons in Gen 1. That evolved by learning a move. No. So I don't have to worry about that. I'm keeping track of when certain mons learn certain moves, thankfully. Oh, look at James. Jesse and James were always some of my favorite characters. Oh, that looks like it's gonna crack and flood. <laughs> a nugget. That will buy me a lot of great balls. Oh, now Moonstone. Excellent. Please be the Paris and not the Zubat. Okay. Cause the Zubat was right there and it's gonna, it's gonna get me after. <sighs> come on, come on, come on. Okay, excellent. Add it to the chain. Okay, now we're going to find out. 15 or 16? I thought Bulbasaur was a smart choice in things like Professor X1 because it evolves a level earlier, right? Guess not. Unless 16 is earlier and the rest evolve like 17, 18. I'm getting out of here. Oh, look at that. No bombard it right from, and it's for our chain. We're at seven, which isn't bad because 10 is generally the lowest chain I've ever had anything special spawn at. So, I forget, what did we get up to with Ekans? Did we get to 10 or did we get just shy of 10? Huh. I'll have to watch it back. Oh, the sand trail. Oh, sand trail. I'm not in this game. Um, does bite do? Bite doesn't do much, but let's just go back. Okay, yeah, bite did nothing. Right? Totally did nothing. Let's 
point. So I think in Celadon, we... Is it Celadon? Cer Cerulean? No, Cerulean. We are able to... Um, on a pearl. Learn some of Eevee's. Okay, so if we're running low, he'll give us Pokeballs. That's excellent. I still want to know if there's a doctor. Not that we're in a position where we have no healing. But I do just want to know if I'm right or wrong about that. That's more of a... Was I right? Am I just a know-it-all? Okay, so we got two here. Ooh, that was not a good sound. I think that was... My chair coming... Hopping out there. Um, quick attack did like my shit. Oh, no shit. That's why we have double kick for rock types. Dumbass. Look at that. That was so much better. Do I do another shield dude? No, we don't need to. We don't need to switch. And double kick. Okay. I thought that would have been worse. Why are you- No, stop avoiding my attack and just die. Die like a man. Come on. <laughs> Is my Eevee gonna die? Thank you. Like, that fight was longer than it had to be there, dude. Just accept fate. I love how he's, like, scratching his beard. Oh, there's Meowth now. Um, what question? How far down do we have to be until we start seeing Clefairy? There's no way Clefairy is the rare spawn. I'm pretty sure it's Clefable, right? Okay. Okay. It's just ambushing me. Which is A-OK -okay with me. That was cheap. Okay. Give me a minute here. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, where are we at now? We're like nine. We gotta be at least with like nine, right? Okay, only eight. So two more till we're at another revive. Lots of stuff in this cave. Very lit nice. There that we can address later. When things start popping up at me, they start catching my eye. And it's like, no, no, focus, focus. Um, a psychic, so a dark type move, psychic dark, right? 
Oh yeah, super effective. Mojian around here. Like, how do we get down there? Is that like somewhere we can get to? No. I don't do these dark color things, fossils. this one. Nope. Nothing. Come on, we're like so close. Okay, let's go. So this will be nine. Okay, come on. Just stay in with us. Don't need, excellent. Don't need to make things difficult. Combo number nine. And no. Oh, excellent. We're going to 10. We're going to 10. Major leagues, I am not. Come on. <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> Come on, stay, stay pretty. Yep. Okay. Fable, please appear. Or a cliff fairy. I'll take a cliff fairy at this point. Give me two cliff fairies. I will smack a moonstone into one of its heads until it evolve and call it a day. Well, you know what? 11. 11 might be a lucky number. Let's go. Actually, 22 is my lucky number. Oh, I feel cheated. I tried to catch that one. Yes. Okay. We are 11 now. We should. We were at 11 when we caught our Bulbasaurus. Are you kidding? Is Chansey the rare spawn and I was just bullshitting myself? I mean, if Chansey's a rare spawn, I will take it. Fuck it. Let's get Chansey out of the way then. I fought Clefable was the rare spawn. Come on, pretty girl. Come on, pretty girl. Come with us. Okay. Okay. I I see you. I see that you want to be part of our our challenge here, and I appreciate you. Okay, we got level. No. Granta evolves at twenty, so we got about five levels left on it. Okay. Yep, there it goes. You may evolve. You are going to be our Venusaur. Because you will get levels faster than the other one because you got more XP so far.
And we got Chansey. Chansey out of the way, because Chansey can be a pain in the ass. I still need Clefairies. <laughs> Where in this forsaken mountain do I find Clefairies? Because we're almost at the end. Holy shit. I mean, if I ever need a chain in this mountain again, uh, Zubats. Zubats is where the chain is at. No. I will look it up if I have to. Where are the Clefairies? There's our friend Paris. Hi, Paris. What's doing? I don't need you hunt anymore, hun. You can stop showing up for me. But if you come across your friend Clefairy, please let her know I'm looking for her. Oh, I know where that is. Okay, we're just gonna go forward. If we need to come back, we can come back. There's no law saying once we leave an area, we will never come back to it. Because they're always in Mount Moon, but what? I know there's certain floors, certain floors they appear on, and I thought they were the rare spawn, or at least Clefable was the rare spawn. But we got chances, so. Um, bite? Bite it? Bite it. When in doubt, bite it. It's a pretty good motto to live by. I was trying to go over to see if there's anything in that crater. Why'd you stop me? They're both yours? No. No, 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 sir. They're both mine. Oh, he's got electric types. Why does that suddenly scare me? Um, let's double keg. See what Doug does. That's decent. And then quick attack for the end. Light screen. Against special moves. Okay. Well, good thing I'm using physical moves. Yeah, because light screen is special moves. And then reflect is for physical, right? Reflects what it was. And magnetite. Magnonite magna magnemite. And that's down. Excellent. So we get a fossil. The other one can be attained at the end of the game. So it doesn't really matter which one we pick up at this point um we're gonna have to get four of them regardless eventually through hunting so at the end it doesn't really matter but uh you know the helix fossil I gotta I, I am a part of the uh felix cult Praise Helix. So, um, it, it, it would be against my cult values here if I did anything else. Oh, shit. oh Paris. Oh, no. I did not want you. Let's go. Nope. 
from this one. Excellent. Okay. Oh shoot. Not from this one. Okay. And so we're getting ambushed. <laughs> the spinning motion. Team Rocket blasts off to the speed of life. Surrender now or prepare to fight is what they should have done. If they were going to commit to Jesse and James, they should have committed. But just funny enough, so Jesse and James don't appear anywhere. They, they do not exist within the realm of red and blue. It wasn't until yellow, which they based it off of the anime. Uh, let's go for damage on either, on both of them at the same time. Okay, this is gonna hurt somebody. Oh, acid hits both, wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. I'm just gonna go for a quick attack. At least they only have one mon each, so even if it takes a few turns. Oh, acid. I'm just picking a little rotata here. That's not very nice. And this should be the Ekans down. Yeah, Ekans is gone, so we don't have to worry about acid. I don't know if the coughing will go down. I don't think it will. Okay, it did. Okay. Glad to be corrected there. Okay, we got another Bulbasaur at 16, which means that one's done. That's another one off our list. Bruno looks completely exasperated. He's like, what the fuck? What the fuck does that happen? Go, good boy. Good boy. Oh, you don't like that? What about right here? Right here. Oh, I'm sorry. We'll stick to your head. Good boy. Go for your ears. Play for your ears. No. Oh, oh. Angry. We were just petting your head a little minute ago and you were liking it. Okay. Are you feeling better? Good. Feel better. Oh, oh, oh. Here we go. It's about dang time we find one of you. Oh, that did not do anything. Oh, you. No, stop throwing straight. Okay, now throw it straight. Trying to throw to the side. Oh, don't move. I redo, don't move. Okay. Oh, 
Oh no. That didn't go. <gasps> oh, it took me forever to find one. That's bullshit. Okay. You know what? We're gonna play the in and out game. No, Zubats. Nope. What about up here? What do we find up here? I don't want that. I don't want to leave. I want cliff berries. Oh, where, where, where is cliff berries? We'll go through the whole thing again. Come on, Zubat, get out of the way. We're looking for cliff fairies, not Zubats. Do I need a chain or something for them? Because last time I got a chain going, we got a Chansey. There we go. What, what one? Uh, we're going to give a berry to make this thing calm the F down. Right? There we go. Perfect. Come on. Oh! Come on. I'm going to use another berry if this doesn't work out. Bury it. We're going to use a great ball. Okay, we got one out of two that we need. And then we can slap a moonstone and call it a day. Okay, Dex, yep. Where, where, where is Clefairy? There we go, there we go. So we're going right into Great Balls. Actually, no, we're not, because we're going to use a berry. And now, we're going to use. I was supposed to Great Ball. Come on, stay, stay, stay in the ball, stay, stay, stay in the ball, stay, stay, stay in the dick ball. Come on. Come on. Come on, come on. Okay, we're done here. We can say goodbye to Mount Moon. Pickens is doing some nice stuff. Yeah, we gotta catch combo too. Nice, excellent. What we're going to do here is use Ivysaur. Let's remove from the party. Um. Okay, so what we need to do is first of all send our extras. you extras. I thought we had three cliff areas for men. Like, there's no way I caught one and did not notice. 
but it, it's the chancy. <laughs> it's the chancy that we got. Excellent here. So, oh no. Bag. Do I have to have it in my. Okay, I do have to have it in my party, so. Let's just do this one because it makes more sense. Alright, next evolution here. Beautiful. Look at her. She's so pink. Pink is the most awful color in my opinion, but some people like it. And she's definitely pink. Um, I will allow you just because that's your signature move. And, you know, it might be fun. Uh, we'll get rid of Defense Curl. are going to put Paris on the team here. Give me a minute here. I'm just going to throw one of these guys on. Um, add to the party. There we go. Let's get out of here. So long, farewell. We're leaving Mount Moon. Excellent. Thank you. I appreciate being out in the fresh air here. And we got five more Pokeballs. Can we get some, like, great balls? Like, Pokeballs are starting to lose their, uh, their value. Paralyzed Heal, that's pretty nice. Um, nothing up. Is there something up here? This is just a very suspicious area, and Eevee did not react to it, so. I don't think I can get up to that Pokeball just yet. I think I have to be able to get to Cerulean Cave first. Do it in there. Yeah, down here. And that just goes up to here. Okay. I'm ready to commit because once you jump down, there's really no going back. Oh, rat, rat, rat. I need rats. I need at least two. Two more rats. Um, I'm not using great balls. What the hell is wrong with me? Not on a rat. Are you kidding? You're a rat. Just stay in. Should not be this hard to catch a rat. It. How dare it! That 
Okay. Well, it's a good thing. I'm pretty sure I can find Firo elsewhere. And I already got Ekans. Alright, so that's pretty much it. I don't need a snack. What I do need is two rats. Ooh, Psyduck. I will not say no to a Psyduck. And we can catch a gold duck later. So I don't have to sit here and level a Psyduck. Thankfully. Oh. to like twist my chair so the way my arm is sitting okay another one but excuse you computer monitor over here wake the hell up Wake up. Perfect. I still need rats. That was a very nice surprise, but I still need rats. Anyway, I can find rats multiple places. Oh, I did not notice that there. Thank you. One spawn. Look at that! It's like, hey, I want to come join your adventure. Come, come! Come on, you were so eager. Come on, you were eager. What was with the whole, like, I want to come with you? Pick me, pick me. That was like so pick me attitude. Come on. Perfect. Okay. We got one. We'll just see if another one did spawn in. We're not really it's just gonna Okay. We're just going to move on. It's not like we can't find them elsewhere. It's not like certain mons, which uh, will just be nameless at this point, which only can be found in certain areas. So this girl's going to give us our Bulbasaur. I didn't want to talk to the Bulbasaur. I want to talk to the girl. Yeah, I can trust. My Pokemon caught so far. Incredible. Yeah. I totally want this Bulbasaur. Thank you. Thank you for giving me the Bulbasaur. Excellent. So we got all our Bulbasaurs in a row. Um, oh. Oh, he's hypnotized. You want to go see the fountain? Come here. Take a look. Sure. Make a wish. So much money to throw into a fountain. Normally you throw a dime, a quarter, maybe a nickel. If you're like super like I don't give an F, you might throw a loony or a toony in. But like 50 bucks. Cause that's what I'm accounting polka dollars for. Like each polka dollar is like a dollar. That's probably not how that works, but that's how my mind sees it. It's like that's a lot of money to just throw in to any old just fountain. I was right. We can learn some of the moves. Oh, can we learn the um, zippy zap? 
Because, you, you know, we're going to battle Misty at some point. Do I have to find her? Is this like, um... We're one of those where we have to find Misty before we can battle her? Can I just go battle her and then do the up route things? Thank you. Yeah. Uh, Buzzy Buzz, Zilly Slide. I thought it was Zippy Zap. Buzzy Buzz. Okay, I guess it's Buzzy Buzz. Okay, yeah. We'll do Buzzy Buzz. Because what, there's a move in this game for what every type Eevee can evolve into? Or is it just these three? Can you teach me another one? I need to bubble. Bouncy bubble. It's probably like a water move, right? Um. Actually, we don't need that right now. But. A move I will need before we get fly. The option to fly around is the fire one. This is Lily Slide. Zippy Zap must be um, Pikachu's move then. Because I'm like, Zippy Zap. That seems so familiar of a name. Like, there's no way I was just mistaken. But it's 100% that it might just be Pikachu's. Um, where's the gem? Are you going to make me wait, or can I just go in? What's the criteria is here? Emergency. Oh, Champion Misty. It's a power for Champion. need at least level. Okay, well. Gee, I have a lot of mods that fit this description. Thank you very much. I kind of like this, how they dive off and, like, come beat. Come fight ya. That is a nice touch to this gym. Um, After the stream, I am dealing with that right away. Oh, it's called Dino's Kick Quick Attack. Well, we're gonna just electrocute you, Godine, so it's okay. It's okay. Come on, get down here. It should just go down, right? My goal before we end stream is to get crew messy and to beat Jasper at the bridge. Then we'll probably call it a night. So this, no, at this level it won't have a nice type move, I don't believe. Because if it did, that could be scary. Oh, we got the paralysis! 
keep up that energy for Misty because that darn me scares me. Because it has a habit in my past experience with Misty and Starmie of just destroying my day. My day would just be all nice. We're just happy go lucky. And then she sends out Starmie and it's like, no. This happy attitude of yours gotta stop. And all out offensive before people. Yeah. So let's go. Let's go, Misty. Alright, so she's got a side duck. That's not too bad. Because I don't think it knows any. It might know confusion. May no confusion. Not that it matters. That was a one hit KO. Okay. Send out your big guns. Yep, nope. This is the best mod I have to handle this, so. Oh my gosh! <laughs> we got the paralysis twice. It hurt. And it got the burn on us. I don't think it's gonna make a difference because we should kill here. Down it goes. Excellent. Done. Misty is done. We're gonna go heal. We're gonna take on Jasper. Eh, what time is it? It's only 9.13. Uh, Bold moves. No. Bruno, Bruno's moveset's good. The way it is. I might go in and just learn. Oh, there we go. Our Charmander's evolving. So this one will go to Charizard. And the other one that will get up that route, that will go to Charmeleon. And I'm not... We'll get Charmander from Shield. Because we get it at the end when you beat Leon, he gives you one. So um, we don't have to sit here and chain again for one. Thank you, Misty. That was a nice battle. But I'm going to go now. And we're going to heal. And you know what? I might. We might have time for Nugget Bridge. Oh, can you just stop and get to the counter? See you again. Get out of the way. Thank you. Oh, oh, how do I get how do I get there? Is it this one? Nope. I just saw it and like nope, need it. This one. This one should give it to me. Oh, rare candy. Excellent. 
I save all my rare candies to the end. That's just how I play. So that I can save them for leak time. Or in this case, trying to... Because you, you actually have to beat Mewtwo before you can catch it. It's not like other mons where you just go. You, you actually have to battle it first. Which is a pain in the arse. So... <laughs> what the fuck's with the... Looks like there's a booger coming out of his mouth. <laughs> oh, Jasper. Pidgey. He's what? Got Pidgey, a Pikachu, and a rat? Is that his team? Well, nothing clips a flying type quite like some uh, electric. Oh, he's got an Oddish. Yeah, no, we're good. Yeah, we're good, because look at this, look at this. Slizzly slide. Excellent. Look at that. So no Pikachu. Yep, yeah, no. We got Pikachu. Um, let's just use bite and see what happens. It's not like I have to worry about static. And again. Look at this asshole just healed. What the fuck? I don't appreciate when you heal. Not allowed. Only I'm allowed. Then the rules. <laughs> Look at her face. Deep breaths. Okay, let's try this again. Sorry, it's not like me to lose my cool like that. There's a house up ahead where this famous Pokemon fanatic is supposed to live. I went to stop by because I thought maybe I'd see some rare Pokemon or something. But I found, no freak out when you hear this is, the Pokemon Fnac Bill wasn't there. Instead, there was a Pokemon. That duck! Clearly, you, you have yet to meet Team Rocket and their Meowth, okay? So, ooh. Yummy, buddy! Bruno looks proud and is giving a content smile. Good boy. Okay. We gave it attention. Um, you know what? We got about 11 minutes. Let's see how far. I usually like to end around 9.30. Is usually my sweet time where people start coming on the internet at home and frame rates start dropping. So I try very hard to be off around 9.30. But, uh, sometimes we go over, and sometimes that unfortunately does affect frame rate. So, if we ever go over 9.30, you gotta let me know if it starts lagging or anything. Um, so that we can know that, okay, it's time to end stream, there's too much going on in the internet at my house right now for us to be streaming. Um, that's just kind of... We live in a house of like six people. It tends to take a toll on the internet. Especially at night when everyone's kind of bundled in, ready to watch Prime, Netflix, Disney Plus, that kind of thing. But it'll be nice to just get through Nugget Bridge here. So we've already gotten through. So these are actually going to be really quick battles. Oh, I didn't think they were going to be this quick. Then again, 
This game's really easy if you just rely on your partner, Pikachu, um, Pikachu or Eevee. Sometimes I usually just ban the partner, <laughs> Pikachu and Eevee, just to make the games difficult. But for this one, we're not really... For this challenge that we're doing with the decks, it, it's not really about the gameplay. It's about the catching the mons and seeing how far you can go with three games. That's more the the experiment with this series that I'm working towards is if you only have access to three games, no online trading or anything, um, obviously home, or not necessarily home, I'm using home as my base, but if you don't have home and you're just collecting the mons in each game individually, how far can you go? Now I've got a pop up on this one screen that needs to go because now I can't see. Okay, there we go. Do not cover my frame rate. Pop up. Sand true. Ooh. Let's bite it. That's the only thing I can think of that would. Because <laughs> it's a ground type. I don't have a water move. I should just go grab the water move and replace the double. Double kick there. But I'm not going to. I think two of the moves is sufficient. <laughs> I love like the, the stomping of the foot. Okay, so we got like two, three more battles here. Then we're done Nugget Bridge. Okay, a Meowth is, okay, so pretty much normal type. Oh, he's gonna fake me out, and that's what I'm gonna flinch, yep. So just try again. Boom, done. What do you say about that, Meowth? Okay, Ivysaur is 18. Did I take the secondary Ivysaur off? I don't want it to get too high of a level. Not that it'll get too high of a level right now. But it needs to stay where it is. I think so, because I put Paris on my team. Oh, yeah, we gotta go get that. The uh, Charmander. Camper Kevin, Growlithe. Oh, now I really wish I had that uh, water move, because that would make this. Uh, she on its head. Take a nice big butt out of it. Oh, it's going to bite back. Okay, that's fair. If something bit me, I would bite it back too. Bye, Growlithe. Camper Kevin. It was swell battling ya. Thank you for the great balls. And is he gonna battle me or is he just gonna give me the nugget? You be the five train and this fabulous part. Oh no, he's just gonna give me the nugget. Okay. Okay. Oh, Team Rocket. That's right. Very cryptic. I want to join. What? Yeah, I totally want to join. What's this? I want to join. Take me to Giovanni. I want to join. Bullshit, man. Tell me. Asking me. It doesn't even actually give me the chance to choose. That's bullshit. Team Rocket would be fun. A game as a Team Rocket. I know there's a... Um, what do you call it? A ROM hack of one? Um, I probably am going to look into getting that set up one time so that we could play because I think it'd be fun to be the bad guy. 
like games where you get to choose which side of like the law and stuff you're on I like choosing the bad like it's so much funner you can do cooler things when you're not bound by the morality of being the good guy I just I find it stories are more interesting and I didn't mean to hit that but what whatever it, it did the job I meant to go down to the sizzly slide you missed out you missed out on letting me in your skills could be in. yeah I see I could be a top leader Yeah, I'm interested. Give me. Give me, give me, give me, give me. Yes, yes. Got the Charmander. Okay. We're going to catch some mons down here. Oh, I don't need a Pidgey. I do want this. I should be able to catch a Venonat. Can we catch Squirtle here, or is that only in... Oh, shit, I'm like surrounded by shit I don't need. No, we can catch Venonat. Um, I think we can catch Meow. There we go, Venonat. And we can catch a Venomoth elsewhere so we don't need to waste time looking and leveling up another one oh, oh crack a lacking in the shoulder there um, no, I think it needs to be removed just now The question I will have to find out is what is exactly can we catch here? You know what? Let's do one final battle of the stream. Final one here. And then we're gonna do our send off for the night. Sparrow. Sparrow? Uh, oh, what am I doing? So, fuzzy buzz. It's a flying type. Excellent. We're just going to meet our title 70. Okay. That is good. We're sure to get great balls too instead of pokeballs, so that's not bad. Uh, we are just going to run out over this way. I'm going to stand next to this dude that gave us a Charmander. So guys, we are going to end it here tonight. We stream new, roughly noon Atlantic time in the morning. We're doing a Mediterranean style build in The Sims 4 right now for our morning streams. They're usually just very quick, just something quick and easy to do. So right now we're doing some streams of The Sims 4 with builds. And then in the evenings, we're doing our longer streams here, which right now we're playing Let's Go Pikachu Dex Run Edition, where we're trying to see if you have access to three um, of the Switch games. So we're using Let's Go Eevee, Shining Pearl, and Shield. How many mons can you get to complete the decks before you need to look at either buying one of the second editions or an online subscription so that you can trade? So that's currently the project we're working on is what we're calling the Dex Run here. And so we'll be back around 6 Atlantic time tomorrow. And we usually stream until about 9.30 in the evening. So that's generally our schedule here. And I look forward to seeing everyone again. I'm Kira Moon. 
if you miss anything, um, I do upload onto YouTube. The link is on the channel here to all our socials. Any socials I have um, are linked here with our uh, TikTok doesn't really have anything on it quite yet. Um, I was planning to do that and then got sick. Um, YouTube has all our streams uh, eventually. I have a few on back order um, that need to go up. Instagram just has some random things if you like ferrets. Generally, there's a lot of ferret content from Vestemir. He absolutely loves his photo taken and loves just being everywhere. And Twitter, if anything happens, like right now my grandfather is in the hospital, so if anything happens where I have to cancel a stream, Twitter is where you will find that information. Again, links are all on all channels. There's generally links uh, connecting everywhere uh, as well. So everyone, have a good night. If you are in the Atlantic area, we are expecting a huge winter storm, so stay safe. If you are within that storm range, tomorrow's going to be nasty. So until then, guys, have a wonderful night. Stay warm, stay safe, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.